Sodium was given 200 centimeters cube of solution X, uh, in which sodium hydroxide and sodium hydrogen carbonate were both being dissolved. The student carried out two different titrations, sample X uh, using 0.1 mol per decimeter cubic of sulfuric acid. Uh, in the first titration, both sodium hydroxide and sodium hydrogen carbonate were neutralized. In the second titration, only sodium hydroxide was neutralized. So those are the results for the table. You got 25.5 centimeters cubic for both and 18 for just sodium hydroxide. So look at the question now, number one, calculate the amount in mole of sulfuric acid used to neutralize um, only the sodium hydroxide of solution X. You start by working out moles equals to 0 0.1 times 18 divided by 1000, which gives you the result of 0.0018 moles of H2SO4 use neutralized. So calculate the concentration of the of, of sodium hydroxide. Calculate the concentration of the MQ of sodium hydroxide in solution X. So to solve this problem, we need to know how many moles of sodium hydroxide are there. So to do the, the moles of sodium hydroxide, you look at the ratio which is 2 to 1. So look at that ratio, so therefore the moles of sodium hydrogen carbonate will be 0 0.0018 times 2, which equals to 0 0.0036 moles of sodium hydroxide used. So to work out concentration, we need to do mole equals to concentration times volume divided by 1000. So moles is going to be 0.0036 equals concentration times the volume, which is 25 divided by 1000. You rearrange this and that should give you concentration of, uh, concentration should be 0.144 mole per dm cubed is the answer. If you don't know how to rearrange this equation, I'll just show you how to quickly how to do it. You take this, you multiply by that, and divide by that. So if you put 0.0036 times a thousand, that will get rid of that thousand there, equals to that times that. So if you divide that by 25, it will give you the concentration. Okay? That's now work out this question, carry on with the same question. Calculate the amount of moles of sodium hydrogen carbonate in 200 centimeters cubed of solution X. To work that out, we need to work out first the volume. The volume is 29 total, 0.5, minus 18 equals to 11.5 centimeters cubed, just for hydrogen volume of sodium hydrogen carbonate. Oh no, volume of sulfuric acid used to neutralize, neutralize sodium HCO3. Once you know that, you work out moles, uh, moles of H2SO4 equals to 0 0.1 times 11.5 divided by 1000, which equals to 0 0.00115. Because the ratio is 2 to 1 between sodium carbonate and sulfuric acid, so if you know the moles of this, sodium carbonate moles, for sodium hydrogen carbonate moles is going to be twice as much. So it's going to be moles of sodium hydrogen carbonate equals 2 times 0 0.00115 which is equals to 0 0.00115 times 2 which equals to 0 0.0023 moles of sodium hydrogen carbonate in the solution but they want you to work out in 200. This is, is in 25. So how much is in 200? 
So it'll be 0 0.0023 times 200 divided by 25. And that will give you uh, the answer of 0. Point, let me check that. Uh, 0 0.0184 moles. 0 0.0184 moles of sodium hydrogen carbonate in 200 centimeters volume. Calculate the mass of sodium hydrogen carbonate in the 200, so you go moles equals mass over molar mass. The molar mass of sodium hydrogen carbonate is 84. So therefore it's going to be, so MR is 84, if you add them all together. So it's going to be 0 0.0184 times 84, which gives you the answer of 15.46 grams in and the answer in 3 dm cube is going to in 3 sig fix is going to be 15.5 grams so let's check that quite quickly 0 0.0184 times 84 yeah 1546 yeah so it says to 3 sig fix and that's how you answer that question